Chris Heria. This man needs no introduction. He's incredibly strong, completely shredded, and one of the greatest inspirations for millions of people starting their fitness journey. And it makes me wonder, what does it take to reach the level of success that Chris has achieved in his physique and career? I personally only have a slight idea as to what he does. Since over one year ago, I created this video where I trained like him for 30 days. However, I only focused on his training regimen in that video. I didn't factor in his diet and all the other rituals that he follows day in and day out. For all we know, he could be eating Hershey bars for breakfast and drinking Cokes to fuel his workouts. So I decided to dig a little deeper. And after a bit of research, I found this video of Chris explaining the exact routine he follows every single day. So I decided that I will be following Chris Harry's routine for the next 24 hours. Will I be doing thousands of muscle ups and eating one arm pull ups for breakfast, lunch, and dinner? Let's find out. What's up, Elite Thenix athletes? You might be confused right now. I'm not Chris Heria. I'm still Brandon William. Uh, I know the tattoos probably threw you off right there. But today is the day that we are eating and training like Chris Heria. It is 7 a.m. and the very first thing that he does is of course 100 push-ups. Push-ups would be the last thing that I do when I first wake up, but we're Chris Heria for today and we are calcinic gods, so we gotta do them. Oh You're a fan, right? I can get these for real? Hell no. <laughs> After I banged out my 50 diamond push-ups and then 50 wide push-ups, it was time for Chris Harrier's breakfast, which was a thick, calorically dense glass of water. That's it. That's literally all Chris has for breakfast. He says he drinks a bunch of water so that his body retains less water and it makes him more shredded. <sighs> the only time I'm going to get to eat now is six hours, which is midday, and that's the only time he has his first meal. So specifically what Chris does from now until midday is he skateboards, he works on his business, and then he buys some groceries as well. So we're going to do the exact same thing because we are Chris Harrier today. First up is skateboarding, but the only issue is I don't actually own a board. So we headed over to Walmart and bought the most Chris Harrier looking one we could find. All right, here we are with our brand new Walmart board. No! Come back here. Mr. Beast literally just cleaned out so much plastic from the ocean. I'm not going to contribute to it going back into there. Dude, honestly, I look like I could be the evil YouTuber right now. Set up a fundraiser. Guys, every single dollar you donate, we take one pot of the trash they took out and put it back. Do I look like Chris? Oh, okay. I am literally the Walmart Chris Harrier right now. Can't do nearly as many calisthenic skills as him. Tattoos that are half peeling. A literal Walmart skateboard. I'm going to try to pop a nice ollie here. Huh? A little bit? For the next 30 minutes, I did my best to enjoy the skateboarding session. Are you f***ing kidding me? <laughs> this board is so bad. And I focus on upping my heart rate, since Chris uses the skateboarding session as a workout to burn extra fat while fasting. Alright, I'm kind of done. That was the least enjoyable ride I've ever had on a skateboard. Next, it's time to shop for some groceries. Chris eats extremely clean every day, so I loaded up on some lean meat as well as complex carbs to make my meals out of. Alright, now it's time to get some work done. Chris Harry is a very busy person, he's always working on something. And for me, I'm currently finishing up my next workout program, which is called Hybrid God. It mixes weights and calisthenics, and I'm going to be releasing it here at the end of the year. And I just have a few more things to be finishing up, and it should be fully complete. I am starving right now. But luckily, we're just about an hour away of getting some food. I'm looking forward to it. All right, finish up the work. Now we can finally have our lunch. I'm so excited, so hungry. Let's do it. We have got our lunch ready. We've got our lean chicken with some white quinoa and then some spinach on the side. And of course, we have our water as well. Damn, that's good. Derek was directing me on the spices. I gotta say, he picked the right ones. Now we'll get some of our, uh, mm, 
some quinoa in there. I would definitely rate this Chris Harrier lunch somewhere around nine out of 10. It's really solid. I already feel more shredded today. And now we're just gonna enjoy the meal. After we finish this, we're gonna go do Chris Harrier's back and bicep workout at the calisthenics park. I'm gonna bring his weight vest. We're gonna do some muscle ups and weighted pull ups, a lot of fun stuff. But before we do our workout, Chris mentions that he has a protein shake before his workouts. So that's what we're gonna do as well. We of course have our favorite, which is chocolate from Transparent Labs. So we're gonna get eight ounces of water up in there, just like that. And now we're also going to put in one scoop of our chocolate protein right in there. Oh, it tastes fire. the way to pull-ups and next up we have inverted row pull-ups but this time we're not wearing this weight vest this, this is heavy dude <laughs> wrap on the back and bicep workout from Chris Haria. We're finally back home after the workout. I took a quick shower and now it's time to have the Chris Haria dinner. And here we are with Chris Harry's dinner. We have salmon on skewers with some white quinoa and then some sweet potato. Gotta say, this looks quite delicious. I'm very, very excited to try this because I'm starving after that workout. There's a nice little close-up of it. <sighs> My mouth is watering. Oh, man. Woo! Очень вкусно. Лобайска, no. This with the white quinoa and the sweet potato, man. This is an absolute banger of a meal. I'm gonna eat like Chris Harrier from now on every single day. Minus the intermittent fasting. I think it's a little bit too much to fast until two. But anyway, if you enjoy this video, make sure you leave a like and also subscribe to the channel. We're almost at 300,000 subscribers. I really want to get there before the end of the year, so make sure you subscribe if you enjoy the video. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.